Hey y'all, so I have the games organized now. Uh, those are the non-sports related type games and down there are the sports related games. As you can see, there's uh, about, well, I ended up with around 50 games. Now I've already sold a couple, um, but uh, just to give you all an idea of what we've got here, We've got uh, Across the Rhine, it's an old tank game, Ascendancy, the Galactic Challenge of Exploration and Frontier, um, Adam, the Inside Story of the Human Body, Lights, Camera, Action, which is America's Funniest Home Videos, Bedlam, Breach 3, Chaos, Control, Deadlock, Diamonds 3D, which is a bunch of arcade type things. Uh, election game, the Doonesbury election game. This was from the campaign 96. I bet you that would be funny. Now this one right here, Master Levels for Doom 2. I just sold this one. All right. A um, hundred bucks. So this one is coming with me to get packed up and sent off. Uh, it's going to be extremely well cared for. Uh, bubble wrapped a box to protect it. Uh, so clearly that that was a uh, collector, a game collector. Uh, so the last dynasty over here, we got Falcon 3.0. One of them is unopened, the other one is opened. Uh, the, the Geek Wad, um, Gender Wars, Marco Polo, Millennium Action, Panzer General, Shadows, Karn, Space Team, Scorcher, which is a racing game. Maybe I ought to put that back down with the sports guys and stuff. Star Command, Tempest 2000, The War College. Welcome to the Future and XS. Now, down below, we've got sports games. They're not quite as well organized yet. I still need to work on that. Um, so we've got uh, Aaron versus Ruth. Um, oh, these don't belong there. These belong up here. Here's Bruce Jenner's Decathlon. Uh, VR soccer. Olympic gold. I'm not sure that's really a game. That might just be a, because uh, it's a Discovery Channel thing, so that's probably more like a um, informational. Uh, Jack Nicholas collection. NHL 98, 212 Open Ice Challenge, NHL Power Play, NHL Hockey, Slam, that's a basketball kind of game, and NFL Yearbook, which again, that might be more of a informational, not so much a real game kind of thing. I'm not sure. So... That's everything that I have now uh, in the way of games that need to get sold, got them organized. I've, I had this extra shelving, so it was convenient to put it all up on this, make it easy for me to get to things. Now that I have committed to selling stuff on eBay, uh, I might as well do it right and get it organized. Okay, y'all, this was just a quick update on how I'm doing with, uh, again, this came out of that computer store, so, you know, it's going to count against the stuff that came out of the computer store. Uh, and uh, you know, you, you just never know sometimes what's gonna be worth some value. So for instance, that game that I just sold on eBay, this Master Levels for Dune, Doom, excuse me. Let's get it up here where you can see it correctly. Sorry about that. Master Levels for Doom 2. This sold for $100. Now, uh, think about that, $100, how many truckloads of scrap? Yeah, you know, the best I've done so far for scrap was $25. So that would have been four truckloads to equal that one box that doesn't even weigh a pound. <laughs> Interesting when you put things into a certain perspective, isn't it? Okay, everybody, have a good one. We'll talk with you all later on.